all good. Yeah? Oh my God, I remember when I planted that. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Hold on. What? Can you just... You're good, you're good. Yeah? You look amazing. Amazing. Really? You're, you're perfect. And that's actually uh, Dad's favorite color. Pod? Yeah. Okay. You nailed it. Okay. <laughs> Ready? Um, yes. I'd be nervous. What? I'm kidding, I'm kidding. We're good. Come on, let's just go. Oh, watch your step. Ah. Mother! The dinner party was so fantastic. It had such an incredible cast of characters, truly characters, um, that all held their own in their own right. Um, and I love that there were there were two straight men. Um, in, in this comedy bit, which I think just really added to the hilarity of everything because it wasn't just her realizing, oh, these people are, are crazy. Um, there was also somebody else who she could commiserate with. Um, so yeah, I just, I just loved the concept and, um, that the ex-girlfriend that came in who was just everything and more. Um, and then the fact that it went viral afterwards. I, I loved every single moment of it. It was amazing. The, the casting was 10 out of 10. The writing was amazing. And uh, I think it really, really hit home and audiences are going to love this. So it was a very interesting, very funny movie. Um, you know, it was uh, it was a good satire of, uh, you know, the upper class, but also just of um, human beings in general and how silly and crazy we can be. It's interesting, it kind of subverts your expectations for sure because you, gotta, you really go into it cheering for this couple, wanting them to make it, but in the end, really, you're just on her side. The guy's kind of a dweeb. Um, but uh, everybody was very funny. The actors were all did a great job. Um, it was, uh, yeah, it was interesting how in the end, you're really just with her and you're definitely with the, the brother-in-law whom she ends up retreating with at the end uh, there. And, um, and yeah, yeah, you just kind of... All, all you can think is you really want her to go on and have a great life and leave these people behind. <laughs> but, um, but uh, yeah, no, it was really funny, really well done, really uh, just great assembling of, of a good cast and getting the whole movie uh, and a whole story, a whole experience done just in one location with one cast, you know, it was, uh, but it was not a small undertaking, you know, at all. So a uh, great, good script, directing, editing, acting, good, good score. Um, yeah, everything was just really well done. I thought the dinner party was really funny. Um, I love the scenario and the dialogue and the sense of hilarity about some of the dialogue pieces and the context. It was kind of like, oh my gosh, what is going to happen next? Um, and I just thought that it flowed so well together and was, was re a really great comedic um, piece. Really enjoyed this film. Super funny and kind of knew it was going to be that just even from the opening scene, you know, the joke of, you know. That's dad's favorite color and it's plaid. It's just so funny. Um, yeah, it was just great. Great ensemble cast. Shout out to Meadow Soprano. That was that was sick. Um, wasn't expecting her to pop up in these these shorts. Um, yeah, it's just great. Just a great script and you know, keep upping the ante and making the family crazier and crazier, and making it just so awful for Serena. It's, you know. Just great stuff, you know, from the ashes and, and the mother being weird <laughs> and then the ex coming and then the ex, they were engaged. It, it's just, you know, great, great reveals and, um, yeah, just great twists and, and, yeah, it was a great job. So, congrats. So, I just wanted to say you guys did a really great job with the dinner party. I think one of the strengths of this film was that you guys did a really great job of creating just very distinct characters and I think the actors did a really great job of representing those distinct characters. Um, a lot of the humor you guys um, wrote was just felt super contemporary and up to date with the times which is just a testament to your guys's writing skills and your kind of awareness of what's you know going on in popular culture and the culture in general. Um, I thought the cinematography just looked really professional and I thought the ending kind of plot twist with the more quiet character kind of speaking up um, was just a really nice touch. And I just overall thought it was really well done and really funny. So good job. Oh, this was deeply uncomfortable. Uh, this is when you think of bringing uh, a partner 
home to the family. This is the nightmare that everybody dreads. Worst possible scenario for each character. And I thought every single one of the characters were driven to their peak absurdity with uh, just excellent excellent performances they had uh, so much range so much commitment to it and you could it was so fun to see how these wild and wonderful characters kind of bounced off of each other and uh, built this uncomfortable evening uh, they just really sat the whole piece sat on the razor's edge of believability and uh, I thought the pacing was absolutely excellent to help keep it keep the energy up but also leave those spaces uh, to let us just wallow in the uncomfortability the injustice of it all which got us on her side and uh, the script was spot on the the writing was lovely I thought the uh, ex-girlfriend studying space politics and space policy uh, perfection uh, yeah love this piece very very professionally done.